Good morning, everyone. Squeakerwood ACG coming to you on Thursday. I hope this is working. I hate to do this every single time, but you know, after you do this many times, over and over and over, and it keeps saying no sound, no sound. It's like, nah! makes me bonkers. So, anyway, I hope you all are having a wonderful morning. It is around lunchtime, so it's really not morning anymore. Um, I need to figure out what I'm going to eat today. I have had iced coffee with sugar-free coconut, sugar-free chocolate sauce, a few drops of almond flavoring, and half and half. And it is yummy. Yummy. Today is my P3 day number 16. I can't even believe it. I was thinking today I've got five more days until I start um, or can go into officially into P4. So I've been doing a lot of thought about this because as you all know, I don't like to transition on anything. It makes me all squirrely. But um, I was talking to Connie earlier today, and you know, one thing that I have to, for me, um, I don't want to gain, I've said this a million times, and I've seen uh, several people have been talking about it recently, is you don't want to, you don't want to lose weight that you've already, you don't want to lose weight that you've already lost. So, um, I have talked about this before, but I will not add in any sugar, no bad carbs, no bad carbs, no wheat, and no sugar. And so what I'm planning on adding in is black beans, some different sorts of beans, and quinoa, and of course, uh, walnuts. <laughs> of course, it's got to have nuts, you know. And, um good fruits, but I will not add any sugar. And uh, also today, there's been a lot of discussion on the fatty liver disease, <coughs> which my naturopath told me that I had. I have to go in, in a couple of weeks and have blood redrawn. And uh, he said he feels like for sure, he just knows that my liver enzymes will be better. But uh, we had discussed this earlier. When you have fatty liver disease, it can cause cirrhosis of the liver, which will, it what your body does, if, if you are, I guess, prone to it, whatever the word is, is that, and, and it's in the book called Fat Chance, is that our body, when we take in excess sugar and bad carbs, that it ferments in your liver, and it causes like a cirrhosis of the liver just from eating bad sugars and bad carbs. So we we damage our health by eating trash, literally. So that's one thing that I don't want to go back to. The whole point of myself doing HCG is to lose the weight and be healthy, to be healthy and satisfied. That is from Miss Susie's body. That's where I want to be. So, anyway, um, that's my plan in five more days is to add in good carbs, good sugars, and be healthy. The other thing that I want to do, and I have 29 days before I start uh, my third round, which I pray that I can get the majority of the weight that I want to lose off. I have 30 more pounds, um, and I know that it gets harder, but I'm just going to try, you know, I mean, I stay pop for the most part. I do add little things, little extra vegetables. I mix my vegetables some, you know, have a salad with some tomato on it. So maybe it's a little mop, but for the most part, I don't have things that I'm not supposed to have. So Anyway, before I start that again in 29 days, that freaks me out because it's time is just going by so quickly. Is um, And in the past, in some of my earlier vlogs, I talked about a liver cleanse. So I am going to do that. I have been taking, um, if you've never taken oregano, oregano oil is awesome for parasites in your body. So I've been taking that. I had to cut back on it because it was making my stomach hurt. So, um, 
<coughs> excuse me, um, a parasite cleanse, and in a couple of days, I'm going to do a kidney cleanse, and then I want to do this liver cleanse, and um, the liver cleanse, it, it does say that you should do a parasite and a kidney cleanse before, but the ingredients in this liver cleanse, um, are in the original protocol for this liver cleanse, you're supposed to use Epsom salts, but it was modified, and you use the mag citrate powder, and you drink around a tablespoon in a mug of hot water, 6 p.m., 8 p.m., 6 a.m., and 8 a.m., and um, then you have olive oil, half a cup. Light olive oil is easier to get down for the best results. Um, and then you use fresh pink grapefruit, one or two large, uh, one large or two small enough to squeeze two thirds cup of juice. Hot wash twice first and then dry. And then you use some orthanine four to eight to be sure that you can go to sleep and black walnut tincture any strength 10 to 20 drops and that's to kill uh, the parasites coming from the liver so anyway I will put the little recipe down um, it's pretty easy but uh, you don't eat anything after 2 p.m. The, de the day before you're going to do it so 2 p.m. do not eat anything 6 p.m. drink one mug of a mag citrate dissolved in hot water 8 p.m. Uh, repeat the drink of a mag citrate at 9.45. Pour half a cup of the olive oil into a pint jar. Add two drops of HCL, which you can't get. Um, so you just leave that off. And then do your grapefruits in it. Remove any pulp with the fork. Um, add the black walnut tincture. Close the jar and shake it. And then you drink it. Uh, don't be more than 15 minutes late. Or you'll get fewer stones. 10 p.m. Uh, you're going to drink the portion, the potion you have mixed, and then take the four capsules, and then you lay down. The next morning, upon awakening, take the third dose of mag citrate. Uh, two hours later, take the fourth of mag citrate, and then you can lay back down. And then, anyway, so if I, I'll put that somewhere since I read the whole thing to you, huh? I've wasted a lot of time, wasted a lot of your time. If you're still here, hey. So um, anyway, I also wanted to mention that if you have not seen um, KB doing HCG or Elena's uh, beautiful vlog, she has everybody's pictures on there, and it is so awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Hope Miss Parker's feeling better. I hope that you just have a little bug or maybe ate something bad, and I hope you don't have an ulcer been praying for you. Um, oh, and Miss Fluffy No Mo. Onion, green onion cheese. I would love to try that. I bet that is yummy, yummy stuff. So anyway, I hope you all are going to have a great afternoon and let's all stick to protocol that we're on. No cheating and stay clean. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.